Twine. Will it go eight? Mike Lee Knox. And all right, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. As impressive right. as the first time he left the shoot, that was the 53rd time Asteroid has lit up. All right, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. <laughs> and you've always said it's not just the combo, or it is the combo of speed as well as movement. Well, I'd like to go all the way back to where the bull's just leaving the chute. The bull actually hangs his horn in that gate, and it kind of holds that bull. <laughs> this time, the timer felt generous. 2.19 is deceptive. Asteroid had Kuhn off immediately. You watch this boy, he almost wants to come out backwards. He kind of backs out and breaks the plane. That's probably what give him the bigger time. You see this boy, time starts now. Bull comes around and just throws that big jump. That is an outstanding leap kick. Bull has had a history of hitting his hip on the gate. Asteroid wins. Do who he had on his back, because that was his best chance to get J.B. Mooney going that direction. He gets him set up around the corner. Brings the fire today. What a great legendary bull asteroid. LJ Jenkins still in the fight for that gold bucket. LJ seemed so good for so long. We're waiting for the scores to come in. And it's just what he needed. 46 and a half points. Asteroid is the 2012 World Champion Bucking Bull. Whatever it takes. Asteroid only ridden one out of his last 19 times. He was close. That wasn't that wasn't just posturing or, or you know, trying to look like the cool guy picking Asteroid. I knew in, in, in Chase Outlaw's, you know, heart and soul, he believed he could ride this bull. He was craving this bull and wanting the opportunity. And I mean, you can tell by his riding, he's not holding anything back. And that's about as close as you can come to riding one of the world's rankest. A great bull, and he's got a chance to do it again this year. Similar to a lot of outs. No matter the cowboy on his back. Really impressed with Asteroid here. This is a bull with a real hair trigger. When they crack that latch on the chute, this bull wants to fire. He got out of the chute clean. A lot of times he'll hip himself. We've seen it with J.B. Mooney and Thackerville. He got out clean right here. Good trip for Asteroid. is really lacking, man. You know, you see Guilherme when he gets rocked to the outside a little bit, look at the ground, and that's not something you ever see from Guilherme Marchi, especially when a bull's spinning into his hand, but you can look right there. You know, he's done gave up right there. He's done said this is over. The clock didn't stop, but officially it's probably going to last about a couple seconds. Coming into this event, Cody Lambert, the livestock director, what, you know, he, he kind of thought they should have rested Asteroid and just saved him up for the finals. The Circle T guys, they said, no, this bull is going as good as ever. He can take it. I think it, they were with no question right.